Do I look pretty? Thank you, I know. Um, let me turn some lights on in here. The one light I have. Hi guys, um, this video is a little different. This vlog's a little different. It's a uh, 2.19, AKA this is my afternoon school routine. Afternoon, night school routine. After school night routine. Yes, um, I'm starting it at two o'clock cause I don't, I'm out of school so I might as well start now. Um, I picked up my cap and gown today, but I left it in my car, so we're gonna go get that. And I'm just so excited because ah, I'm graduating, like, what do you mean? And I'm gonna try it on just for shits and giggles. It's just funny. Where are my shoes? Oh, I, I had to pee. Hold on. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Okay, so before I pass out from hunger, by the way, I feel like I'm very sick right now. So my energy is like not there, but I'm still vlogging because I care about my channel. Oh my gosh, it is so dark in here. Like, hello. That's honestly not much better, so. All right, we're going to make some breakfast sandwiches. Actually, I'm only gonna make one because I'm only making one for myself. Making a breakfast sandwich. So first ingredient is bread, if I can find it. Tell me this, leave a comment down below. Do you put your bread in the freezer or do you leave it out? I have mixed reviews. I do either or, but I think I put it in the freezer for, so it'll last longer. But here's the bread I'm using. Nature Valley. No, Nature's Own. Nature Valley. Pretty sure that's ranch, isn't it? I, I, or that's Hidden Valley. Bored. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Next ingredient I have is half an avocado that I already sliced. It's kind of brown, but it does the job. Like, who cares? Oh, and also my avocado saver is from TJ Maxx. Next ingredient. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Eggs. We're gonna make them like over medium probably in the skillet. And then I have this Applegate uncured turkey bacon and some shredded cheese. While that's all cooking, like I'm gonna cook the bacon. Oh, I'm forgetting the best thing. I'm also gonna put a hash brown patty on there. So while that's all cooking in the air fryer, I'm going to snack on something because I'm so hungry. But that's my fault for waiting so long. Come on, door. Thank you. So I'm gonna have this chia seed pudding that I made like a couple days ago, I think. Yeah, it's just the Okio's Oikos um, Greek yogurt one, vanilla, so. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna Google how long I'm supposed to put that stuff in my air fryer because I really have no clue. And then I'll show you the final product. Okay, I figured out why it was so dark in my shot because my ISO was really fucked up. But anyways, um, that's how I'm gonna lay things out in the air fryer, two slices of turkey bacon and one hash brown patty. And it's gonna go in there for eight minutes at 360 degrees Fahrenheit. And um, I'm gonna show you like this little snack idea I just came up with. It's gonna, I should go on like Shark Tank with this, I think. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Jokes, why am I still filming? That's really awkward. Okay, anyways, while that's cooking, I'm gonna snack on my, or just have like, oops, okay, this is not working. Ugh. Okay, please stay, it's probably gonna fall, but as a snack, I said I'm gonna have my chia seed pudding. I'm going to add a Cliff Bar on top and then my bus, bus, bus. Or I might add this little Kirkland brand one, soft and chewy. Um, when did this expire? May 6th, okay, cool, they're still good. So I'm gonna like sprinkle this on top of my yogurt because I wish I had granola, but I don't. So this is like second best thing. Life hack. <laughs> Cheese, eggs, my turkey bacon, my avocado, red pepper flakes, and I'm waiting on my hash browns, and that's it. Okay, so I put the top part of the sandwich in the um, pan again, because I wanted to try to melt my cheese a little bit, but this part just has the egg and the cheese and the bread, not like the avocado, because I don't want it to be like warm. I don't like warm avocado like at all. And my hash brown's done. Mmm, I'm feeling like Miss Remy Ashton. It's giving Miss Remy. If you didn't know, I'm obsessed with her and I'm leaving that in the microwave just because. And this is gonna be on the side, baby. Protein, yummy, yummy, yummy. Actually, I'm gonna keep this in the fridge. What am I doing?
Okay, let's look at my sandwich here. Tell me that doesn't look amazing. Mmm, yum. All right, I'm gonna eat and watch some volleyball, some YouTube, you know. Okay, don't mind my like air conditioning, not air conditioning, my air purifier going in the background. So, this is what they give us. Um, I don't know what company we get our cap and gowns through, but keep in mind, this is my first time graduating college, like undergrad, so I'm excited. Let's unbox her. First, we have a cap, and I hate caps because they're ugly. Like, actually, I'm not gonna put it on because it's gonna kill my, it's gonna ruin my mood. Um, and then we actually have the gown, which is the ugliest thing. And honestly, this material is so cheap and see-through. Like, I can see you still, you can see me. Not cute, but like, necessary. So we're gonna throw it on. Oh, and then, subtle flex, but I got my honor cord, you know. Cause I'm smart. Um, oh, let me take a thumbnail. Oh, I'm tweaking. I got a tassel as well, and I got this color tassel. I don't know why they're different colors, but I think it's because of like by department or by like degree program, so mine's business, so maybe this is business. It's like a, I don't even know what this is called, like bronzy almost, and it has 2022 on the tassel. So that just goes on the little knob thing. You can't really see it, but the little thing right there. Ooh. Last time I did this, it was high school, so I don't remember how to put it on correctly and how to make it like stay on. That's the issue. Oh Lord, yeah, I don't remember how to do this. I'm gonna have to have someone do that for me. But y'all know the vibes! Oh my gosh, ah, that's so exciting. All right, let's try this bitch on because uh, they also order it by like height. So I'm 5'11", so I got a five, or I got a gown, hopefully, that fits someone who's 5'11", and like under 200 pounds, I think, so. <sighs> Moment of truth. Bruh, it's ugly, bruh. Oh, where your mama at? Does this zip up? Oh, okay. So it's like a half zip moment. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. okay. Come on. What if I break it? That'd be so... <laughs> Do you know how miserable I'd be, bruh? Oh my gosh, it's like jammed. Oh, brother. This guy stinks. Yeah, so it's like not working. So that's concerning because it's like literally like jammed. Um, okay. There we go. <laughs> Have you ever seen like the nun or something? Or like, I look like I'm in an episode of Riverdale. <laughs> and I know y'all know what I'm talking about. All right, let's add all the other accessories here and we'll see how I look. I look like I'm in the choir, the church choir. Like, Wait in the water, face ass, okay. Where's the front? Oh, there goes the tassel. Oh, the front is this way, okay. Oh, my hair's in a bun. That could do it. Okay. Damn, how you put this on, bruh? My head is really big, so. Ooh. Oh, y'all like this? Drip or drown, what? My honor cord. <laughs> Let's go, baby. What? Pull up in the Sri Lanka. What? <laughs> this is so funny. Bro, that's funny, bro. <laughs> oh. Does my hair look good? <laughs> it fits. Nice. Now let's get a good mirror pic. Oh, wow. Yo, I look official. Yo! Okay, period. Period. I did that. I did that. Um, I'm gonna take this off before I ruin it and I'm gonna hang it up in a different closet so I don't touch it and mess with it. I also don't feel like steaming it the day of, so I'm gonna keep it hang up and out of my face. Bow, period. She told me throw it back. Bow. Okay, period. So, update vlog. I have done absolutely nothing. Right now I'm watching 90 Day Fiance. I'm catching up on the rerun because it came on last, no, Sunday and I missed it. So I'm watching the rerun because my sister and I watch it together even though she lives in a different state and we like live text it with each other, live text. 
sorry there's something on my lens um yeah <laughs> i'm literally not doing anything um just chilling you know drinking my water but i promise i'll vlog when i actually do something actually that's a lie i have not been doing nothing i just haven't been vlogging so here i am booking a flight on delta because i'm going back to california um and if you didn't watch that vlog please watch it because i worked really hard on it but i'm booking another flight to california because i'm seeing my other friend who lives out there even though i didn't go to see someone last time i just went with someone but this time i'm going to see someone who lives there so she's one she's my teammate so i'm really excited because she's gonna take me to this disney and i i love disney so yeah i'm booking my flight right now um i hate how expensive flights are like the cheapest one i can find is probably like 550 which is not terrible but it's like not money i want to spend nor do i really have it like that but i saved up a lot last summer so i could have this moment so go go me i'm goaded for that but yeah i'm gonna book right now and then duh on this is okay does anyone else get like major anxiety when like you make like a big purchase like does that make you nervous because it makes me nervous it makes me sick i'm like i don't this is this is so much money but you have to have like what a abundance mindset when it comes to money instead of scarcity or so i don't know something like that but don't i'm not day ramsey don't listen to me i have no clue <laughs> all right lovelies it's seven o'clock on the dot i filmed a main channel video now i'm about to head to kroger because i need a little i think i need two or three ingredients um, I'm just gonna cook at home. I'm gonna make some spaghetti, but I need my garlic bread. Okay, like Texas toast. I need that. Um, I also need like another backup pasta sauce and some sour cream for my chicken tacos I have also prepared. Yeah. Oh, I'm running out of storage. Ugh. Hey guys just got back from Kroger I got like two clips of me being super sus in Kroger because it's like weird for me to film in public so I got some quick things my goal was to be under $20 because that's all I had in my account was literally $20 like flat and it was $20 and 66 cents and I didn't even have 66 cents so I had to use my different card that's okay First bag, I got these Danon, Dan Active Probiotic Dailies. Uh, it's good for gut health and I have really poor gut health and uh, my whole bacteria and like all that stuff is just like the good bacteria, bad bacteria, whatever. It's all out of whack usually because I'm on like <laughs> some medicine, antidepressants, but, and then like birth control so that really hurts me sometimes. Next I got a thing of sour cream. Oh, I'm gonna take the light version. Oh well, got this like squeezy bag, it looks pretty cool. And then I got a backup pasta sauce. I got this random one, it says Muir Glen, I think. M-U-I-R Glen, organic roasted garlic pasta sauce. No sugar added, sick. And then I got the Texas toast like I wanted. I got the five cheese. I don't like the just plain garlic bread, I like mine with cheese. And then, I went down the candy aisle, and if you watch my vlogs, you know I love like sweet anything, like candy, chocolate, gummies. Um, so these were buy two, get one free, so naturally I had to do the deal. So I got a cookies and cream. This is Lint, Lindent, Lindent? I don't know, L-I-N-D-T, Lint. <laughs> uh, this is a cookies and cream white chocolate, plain white chocolate, and then just milk chocolate. So, aren't these so like, gorgeous? So pretty. All right, but now I'm gonna start cooking dinner. I'm just gonna uh, boil some pasta. I think I'm gonna use, I have like a bunch of random different noodles for some reason, but I think I'm gonna use the other half of this pack of linguine. Yeah, linguine from 365, which is like Whole Foods brand, I think. Yeah. Um, and then I'm gonna make some Texas toast in the air fryer, just like one piece probably. And uh, yeah, bone apple tea, that's dinner. Okay, so like first step, boil your noodles. This is a revolutionary, but I do like, you'll see, I'll not over explain it. <clears throat> okay, so what I do to add like some flavor to like jarred sauce is I add some, what is this, minced garlic. 
and I probably like two tablespoons, maybe a little bit more. I like a lot of garlic. Boom. And while that's like sauteing, I'm gonna put it back on the heat here. And then over here I have my noodles drained and I put some olive oil in the bottom to keep them like moist, I guess. And then in this bowl, you can't really see it, but I have some leftover pasta water that I'm gonna add to the sauce. And then I also have some lemon juice and then I'm gonna add seasonings. So I have this Italian seasoning I'm gonna use. It's a blend of marjoram, thyme, basil, rosemary, savory, and oregano. Yeah. Um, some red pepper flakes, crushed red pepper flakes, garlic powder, salt and pepper, and what else do I need? Oh, paprika, yeah, paprika. I like a lot of seasoning. You know, we like flavored food in this house. So I added my leftover sauce. This is Rouse, how do you say that? I don't know, vodka sauce, and I added that in, and then I mixed in my pasta water. Now I'm gonna let that let my eye cool down. I'm gonna simmer it for a little bit, let it chill out. Um, and then at the same time, we're gonna cook our garlic toast. Okay, so last step in my pasta sauce, it's like doing its thing. I read on the internet, in addition to all the stuff I added, you should add like a little splash of like dairy or like something to make it like creamier, savory or whatever. Is that a word? Probably not. But uh, you can use like, and it's like better if you want it to be like more rich, you can use like like whole fat things. So I randomly have this whole milk. I don't even drink milk for real, but I just, I don't know why I have this. But I'm gonna use that. You could use like heavy cream, but this is like pretty much the same thing. I mean, it's probably not, but I'm gonna make it the same thing. So we're gonna add that in. And you wanna add in your dairy like within the last two minutes of your cooking time, just so it keeps the integrity of like dairy, you know? Bon appetit, it's done. <laughs> all right, so the dishes are all in the sink. I don't feel like doing them tonight, so I'm not. Yeah. Uh, next up in my night routine, after cooking dinner, I'm gonna shower. Yeah, shower, shower time. And then I'll take you through my skincare routine, which is really boring and simple, but still gonna show you anyways. Okay, ignore my TV in the background, please. So I washed my face. Um, I wash my face in the shower, I use Cetaphil. Yeah, I either do that or the CeraVe hydrating. Kenza, it's a genre. It's a genre. Okay, now I'm gonna put my moisturizer on because I do like a retinoid thing that's really drying, so I, I do my moisturizer first. So what I do is I take the CeraVe moisturizing cream. Oh, shit, my camera's gonna die. Frick. Ugh, so much for me trying to be a vlogger. Get like that much in the back of your hand. And then I add in my drops of my Indy Lee squalene oil. It won't focus, I'm sorry. Shut up shower, I'm in distress. And I add like a couple drops of that. Mix it and boom. And I'll be back when my camera charges to show you the last step. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Your neck, your neck girl. Don't forget your neck. And then I rub the excess onto my arms and my back, the back of my hand. Now we're gonna let that sit for like 30 minutes and then, like I said, I'll come back and show you what I do next. Now I'm, gonna, I'm also gonna eat some chocolate because I'm feeling kind of sad. <laughs> so I just shot a whole clip and I wasn't recording. So I, this is my last step in my night routine, is this stuff. This is the La Roche Posay Adapalene Gel, 0.1%. And it's really good for like cell turnover, um, dark spots, acne, and stuff like that. So I've been using it. It's pretty good. Um, yeah, I'm in a lot of pain. I really just want to go to bed. Uh, so that's what I'm going to do. Uh, peace out. Make sure you subscribe. Like this video. Leave a comment down below. I'm going to brush my teeth and hit the hay. So deuces. Bye.